Winnie, come on. They're there. Come on. Estão lá. Eles estão esperando a gente. Winnie. Hey, Winnie. How are you today? I'm good. How are you? Yes, I'm fine too. Let me tell you something. We're going to tell them a story. Are you excited about it? Yeah, and you. Yes, I am very excited too. And the story today is about fruit and vegetables. Já que a gente está falando de meio ambiente e de biodiversidade, agora a gente vai falar não só dos bichinhos e de seus habitats, mas das plantinhas, das coisas que a gente come que vem da natureza. Né? Então, a gente hoje vai contar uma história muito especial. Winnie, tell them. This story we are going to tell them is about which animal? A caterpillar! Yes, Winnie, it's about a caterpillar. A hungry caterpillar. So, pay attention now. The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carle. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. Vocês estão vendo ali o ovinho numa folhinha? Pois é, presta atenção agora. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop. Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. I'm hungry, I'm hungry. He started to look for some food. I'm still hungry. On Monday, he ate through one apple. But he was still hungry. Comeu uma maçã na segunda-feira e estava ainda, ó, hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. I'm still hungry. I'm still hungry. Tava com fome ainda, mesmo comendo maçã e pera. Nossa senhora. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. I'm still hungry, I'm still hungry. And on Thursday, he ate through four strawberries, but he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, but he was still hungry. I'm still hungry. On Saturday, he ate through chocolate cake, ice cream, sausage, cupcake, lollipop, watermelon, pie, cheese. Wow. That night, he had a stomachache. Ah. He had a stomachache. He was ill. Oh, I'm ill. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf. And after that, he felt much better. Agora, a caterpillar deixou de ser gulosa e comeu uma folhinha verde como tinha que comer. E aí, ó, ela passou muito melhor. Now, he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. Look, he was a big, fat caterpillar. A big, fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out. Ele construiu a casinha dele. Ficou lá duas semanas lá dentro quietinho. E quando ele fez um buraquinho para sair, Gente, o que, que ele se transformou? Eu sei que vocês sabem. He was a beautiful butterfly. And that's the cycle of a butterfly. Very good. Gostaram dessa história? Pois é. Esse é um ciclo. É o ciclo da borboleta. A gente tem vários ciclos de vida e esse é um deles. E mostrou que ó, comer demais também não é muito bom, né? Que dá ó, dor de barriga e a pessoa fica se sentindo até doente de tanto comer. Não é mesmo? Fiquem aí que tem mais atividades e até a próxima.